as the Swiss government faces pressure from India to share information on citizens suspected of tax evasion, another Pandora's box could actually open up. Now, the Swiss Federal Tax Administration says it cannot rule out more Indian names uh, could come up on their official online gazette in the coming weeks. Now, these are names that Indian authorities need more information on from Switzerland for the black money probe. Names of people that the bank and the Swiss government says they cannot trace. Industrialist Yash Birla and the son-in-law of a late realty baron Pontichada are among several Indians whose names have been disclosed. Notorious for its banking secrecy, Switzerland's move to make account holders' names public has come as a big surprise. Are the Swiss cracking under pressure? Are these the names of those refusing to cooperate? Swiss officials brushed aside these questions to say it was regular procedure. It's just the request from India, and so we have to inform these people. And if we can't find them, then we're going to um, put them in the Federal Gazette. But just the names. But you don't know why we're asking for them. Well, that's a secret. Clearly not all secrets will be revealed just yet. But these are names that Swiss authorities have recognized as being eligible for being examined for tax evasion. Those named are required to get in touch with authorities, failing which their account details will be handed over to India. If the clients ask the Swiss government not to share this information, the case will go to Swiss courts. Either ways, those guilty are likely to get cornered. In 2011, Switzerland received about 370 requests for information. The number shot up to more than 2,700 in 2014, India being among the top three countries, making the highest number of requests. Number one is Croatia, number two is France, number three is India. But Swiss officials cannot reveal in how many cases the information was actually shared and whether this led to money being recovered.